necessarily shared by my colleagues or by uh, almost anybody, and that is we're running out of everything. I think it will become devastatingly clear to everybody. I, I think we went through a great paradigm shift about five years ago, and uh, we'd spent 100 years with almost all commodities declining, perhaps oil, was about flat in real terms, adjusted for inflation, but everything else was declining, copper, corn, and so on. And now you look back five years later, you can't see that clearly at all. A lot of them seem like they've been going up for 50 years, 100 years, copper, uh, iron ore, um, tin, and, and, and oil. Oil is clearly broken out. It spent 100 years at $16 uh, in, in our currency until 1974. And then it doubled when OPEC started, and it spent 20 years trading around 35 plus or minus a lot. And then I think it doubled again, and I think the trend line is probably about 75. So the world has changed. We're entering a period where we're running out of everything. The growth rate of China and India is simply uh, can't be borne by declining quality of, of resources. And, uh, and I think we're in a period that I call a chain-linked uh, crisis. So the world has changed. We're entering a period where we're running out of everything. The growth rate of China and India is simply uh, can't be borne by declining quality of, of resources. And, uh, and I think we're in a period that I call a chain-linked uh, crisis. 